we keep pushing this happiness away from us because we, we achieve something and then we put it down. Yeah, that was the promotion, you know, but what I really wanted is all of that. Instead of acknowledging every step of the way. And this is what the Women's Code is all about. This is what I teach. This is what I share. Is if we were to enjoy the path, we'd be happier in the process. And then we don't constantly push it off. The superhuman paradox, that is a specific um, word I use in the Women's Code. And the superhuman paradox goes like this. My house looks like Martha Stewart's. I cook like Gordon Ramsay. I cherish my inner slut in the bedroom. I had to say that. <laughs> Amen, sister, right? I, uh, I, I have my Pilates or yoga certification, because why do it have ass? I bake award-winning cupcakes for the PTA meeting. I am, you know, the dance mom who is out every Saturday and Sunday with the kids. I make partner at the law firm while I'm still picking up the kids at 5 o'clock and have a home-cooked organic meal on the table at 6 o'clock every night. How in the world did we get there, sisters? How did we allow this insanity to, to take over our... You know, when I say it like that, right? When I say it like that, you go like, why didn't I think of that? That's why women are unhappy. That's why we are bleeding inside. That's why we try to find men that are our girlfriends because we don't have time for meaningful relationships anymore. We can't even take care of ourselves, reach our goals. Who has time to bond with the sisters who all stare us down, you know, bitches, bullies, queen bees, she tyrants, and make our life a living hell? So where do we take, where do we take this? Where do, we, where do we bleed? Where do we feel understood and hurt? So when we take our superhuman paradox and we take all of these things of wanting it all at once and narrowing it down, I'm here to tell you, you can have everything. Just not all at once. <laughs>